is up my lacrosse brothers? I'm doing a video today on how to string your lacrosse head. Alright, so first thing you need to do, get a piece of mesh. I like to use hard mesh on my attack heads um, because first they're really hard, hard mesh, but once you get them broken in, and I'll show you how to break them in, uh, you can get them really soft, almost a soft mesh, but Whenever it gets wet, it won't bag out. Alright, so first thing we need to do is go to the We need to go to the Oh, what is this place called? Yeah, the bathroom. Alright. So you're just gonna wanna get it to some hot water. And start it right on the video. And as you're doing this, pull the metal. Get nice and stretched out. And I'm going to see a towel in here. Crap. Uh, let's go back here. Get a towel. Crap. Oh, Alright, and then just dry it off the mesh. Not dry it off entirely, but so it's not soaking wet. All right. So, all right. I'm gonna. All right. So now I'm not gonna show you how to do. I'm not gonna go through the entire thing because I don't really feel like it. So, first thing you need to do is make sure that you have nine hole folger. Uh, yeah. Okay. So. Whenever you feel the mesh, you should be able to feel um, one side is rougher than the other, and make sure that you have the rough side out, and that gives you more uh, traction on the ball. Um, so then, you also need to make sure they have nine holes across the top. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, just make sure that you got the traction side on the outside. And the first thing you want to do just across the uh, in the first hole, just string it through. See that? So just the first hole, just put it through, and then you're going to put it through the first hole. trick that you can use if you can't get it through is push the string out a little bit and stick it in and just pull <sighs> just pull it and it'll come out that hole again so as you can see we have done a loop to attach the mesh to the head and then just stick it back in there And that's how to start it. Wait, yeah. Oh, crap. So that's the start. She's not here, Levi. She's outside. Mom's outside. With you guys, you know? You guys were biking. Hold on. Come on, go out, okay? Alright, so with this, there's four holes across the top. And you just kind of... Well, this is the juice. This is the Maverick juice. So, if you want to see how to string the Maverick juice later, just hit me up and I'll do it. But to do these, I like to... There's two ways that you can do it. There's this way. I just do the simple way. Uh, there's a simple way, you just go in, yeah, flying out. Hold on, let me get my lighter.
go through the mesh. Alright, watching sliders through it. Through that side. way so you did the first one and you just come on the other side and it's easier it's better to do it with just less holes like this and then, so you make it like that you put it through the second hole you just come back to that exact same hole just kind of push it through and bite it it's neutral and then just come back the exact same way and that will make it more sturdier and better to throw with. So that is the cross lace and you just do that across the top one or two and just make sure you do the loop and you can and then here I'll show you how to do the loop at the end. So the loop at the end just go in so you go into the mesh of pulling the plastic or not the plastic <laughs> okay well you get the gist of it so you just like you put that string and that hole so it just does another loop and you just tie it off with a uh, with a big knot. Alright.